Okay, we're back. Uh, looks like we'll, we should do an initiative? Question mark? Yes. Okay. Who am I adding to the initiative sheet? Not the Belkmans. <laughs> they're not dead. They're just not dead. They're, <laughs> no, they're dead. <laughs> oh, you killed them. They're right. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> All right. So there's Ali. Do you want init in, in, in individuals or? Yeah. Ali. Francine. Franco and Francine. Francine. And I recognize this guy. So Frank. Okay. Uh, what is Franco's initiative modifier? Plus six. Okay. What is Ali's? Ali's is plus five. And Francine. Minus four. Oh. <laughs> uh, plus three. Cool. I'm going to roll some random numbers and hope. Uh, you guys have three rounds to get to me. Well, by you, by you guys, I mean the people that aren't here. <laughs> Shut. <laughs> they told to, to to double time it. They told to pick their way up. All right, it's Grippa's ghost, Mort Franco, the Opera House, Los George, Capra de Sade, Ali Frenzy. Not bad. It's not the best. But... <clears throat> okay, Gripper's a ghost. <laughs> Pops out of the can and starts tearing this guy a new one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Griffith's ghost hops out as a move action. As a free action, he is going to rage. He is a urban blood rager. Fuck uh, him up! And... <laughs> Fuck him up! <laughs> yep. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Los dig get off. How many spells while we were in this room did he get off? Basically across this wall. In this room, you would have gotten two more up. Okay. So Los, Los has cast Greater Invis on himself and Heroism on Grippa. Could you have cast Good Hope through the vase on everyone? He doesn't have Good Hope. Good Hope's a, a bard spell, dude. You what? should get Good Hope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, yeah, I'm, a, yeah. a quite visible Grippa hops out of the can. Um, now, Grippa has a four int, and he's Arcane Bloodline Blood Rager, which means that it's the difficulty of casting spells next to him is plus two DC for concentration cool. checks. That does stack with a feat, which you'll later take. Um, so one move. Ah, oh, damn it, that's standard. Okay, I think I think Gripper is just gonna uh, do a an attack. This will be a bite. How do you splash one? Okay. Yeah, all all the attacks this thing have. <clears throat> have grab. Okay. Uh, plus 16 would be plus 18, and the rage is plus 20. Not 20. Not 20 is a problem. Is he 23 to confirm? Does not confirm. Slap put it. Yeah. Does not yeah. confirm. Check, check your numbers. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds great, sir. Okay, and I can sneak attack him or no? 
Um, he, yes, you can sneak attack. Okay. Grippa did 15 points of damage. Ow. And then the grapple attempt. Uh, 25 on the grapple check. No. Okay, so he doesn't latch on. And then he'll attack one more time. With a clowl. You see 24 flat-footed? Nope. Okay, so. He's being annoying. <clears throat> Oh, sorry. Uh, that should be a little bit more damage. Um, we didn't include uh, the the rage, which increases his dex, which is increases his damage. So uh, two more damage on that. <clears throat> Heroism does not do damage, right? It does only a two. No, nope. okay. I could help. Okay. Don't judge language. There's a good chance that the noise will escape this room during this fight. <laughs> uh, Mort is on his way. And it's three, two, one more time. So Capra is also three, two, one. Out of my way! I'm, I'm having a fecal emergency! <laughs> he yells with Mort. <laughs> <laughs> fecal emergency. Uh, so are, they, are they arriving at one? They're, they're three rounds away. So okay. at one, they arrive. At one, they arrive. Okay. Yeah. Alright. Uh, fuck, kitty, fuck, fuck. <laughs> Franco. Why are you indignant, son of a bitch? There's a ghost and all the things. I told you to be careful, sir. <laughs> you said dumb shit you wouldn't listen. <laughs> Alright, he is going to... His spell list is a little... So he's going to quick act or swift action cast a mirror image. Because, you know. He just cast uh, a six circle spell on it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, that ain't nothing. You should see, you should see what comes next. Uh, all these spells that he has prepared are mostly, like, for the most part, war spells. That's what this is. <laughs> Alright, so... So 1d4 plus 1 for 3 max HP. Okay. Uh, Man! So, seven images. Oh, no. <laughs> that was plus 6. <laughs> yeah. Fuck. So let's. He does not like what's going on here. Oh, that's, I need a mort and a capra. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna roll a d4. Okay. He is covered in magic. As his other action. He has three more spell effects. Right Does he have a weapon in his hand? Uh, does he have a weapon in his hand? Let's see. Um, he, yes. Uh, well, sorry, no. Uh, his hands look claw-like. Mm -hmm. As in, he's threatening. Gotcha. Uh, 
he and his compatriots also seem to be moving fast, um, as well the, um, you're not certain, the other ones don't have like obvious visual effects. Uh, that was Franco. What kind of weapon does he does he have, sir? Claw hands. His hands with hands with like claws. Okay. Opera House. Opera House doesn't know yet. Los. Los will use his uh, his free runner shirt to use a move action to get out. He is in... dabba, dabba, dude. <laughs> he is invisible <laughs> with heroism shield. Dabba, dabba, <laughs> He's got C invis shield, heroism, mirror image, and greater invis running. He also has a regular invis running, which will just go off when nope. he's, left the when he stabs that first guy. All right. Okay, Los is going to uh, burn a mythic point to mage strike this guy. And flank him. Nice. He's in trouble, I think. He is in trouble. He's very hard to hit. Okay. Made, uh, Los is burning a fifth level spell. Okay. This is a plus 10 to hit. Ooh. Is he flat, is he flat footed because of. Can he see invisible he things? Foot. Okay. He hasn't right. gone yet. No, oh, as we established, there are some powers oh. that. Yeah. There are people. Yeah. There, you, there are people in this room who would not be flat footed. Okay. Plus seventeen with piranha strike, plus two for heroism, plus two for the flank, and then plus two because he can't see me. Plus ten for the mage strike. He can see you. He can see me. There's so... no plus two for invisibility. Okay. All the other pluses, yes. AC thirty-four? So he hasn't gone yet, so yeah, that, that hits. Okay, does he take precision damage? Oh, he's got organs, unfortunately. Okay. He's immune to bleed. Okay. That's part of it. Yep, yeah, it would be part of it. Uh, okay. Um, if he had his turn, that would have pissed. <laughs> and then this is a once-per-round con uh, conductive rune, so uh, he's also getting the Giving him the rune? Yeah, we're giving him the, the aging. <laughs> uh, ooh, one second. Um... And I can sneak attack him, you said. Yeah, you can sneak attack him, and yes. He All right, can and the energy that we're giving him is fire. Does he take fire damage? Uh, let me see. Um... Yeah, he'll take fire damage. Um, oh, sorry, one second. He has a... Which one? No, he is resistant to... There's a D2 on what he is resistant to. Uh, one is fire, two is something else. He is resistant to something else. So the fire just goes. Okay. So this is including the mythic point mage strike sneak attack Precision damage and piranha strike. Los does 67 points of damage to him, plus 11d6 that he needs to make a fortitude save or half against. And the DC. Okay. And the DC and there's is... probably a, fort save, a separate fort save for the do not die. Unless he has. The DC is. The DC is a fort save? 23. <laughs> Yeah, so he's taken 106 damage from this first strike. Ha! Ah, best souls whatever! <laughs> oh, yeah. You're looking a little old. You're looking a little tired there, buddy. <laughs> yeah, that's a big fuck you. <laughs> All right, he needs to make a fort save or die. Yep. Should I said you should not attack him. You ah! should not take the bite. He doesn't die. <laughs> okay. He 
Luke Rock most out. displeased. <laughs> Rocked out of his fuckers. Uh, that was your, like that was two actions, I think, or three actions. Uh, 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 actions. Free, free runner shirt to get out, and this is my first attack. So I'll take okay. my iterative attacks now. Thanks. Okay. All right. Now I don't get to use the conductive rune again. That's a yeah. a, a mythic power. We can get to that later. Um, so mythic ghosts get to do it through their weapon with every strike. Yeah. Well, uh, I think at a, they take the power and at a certain level, at a certain mythic level, they get to do it once, twice around, and then once per attack. Yeah, anyways, it's it's sick. Okay, second attack. Um, Let's put more rooms in the this, store. This was at, no, uh, uh, no. So second attack, 1921, which would be a plus 16. Uh, critical threat, 32. Uh, 32 hits because he's flat-footed. 22 to confirm. Uh, what is his flat-footed AC? Is it within... 28. Okay, I'm not I'm not going to search for that. Yeah, you're not going to get yeah, six. Yeah, yeah, that's fine. That's one out of six. That's crazy. <laughs> you crazy gambling man. <laughs> All right. He still takes 48 points of damage from the sneak and the blade and... All the precision. All right, he is very hurt. He is very much not liking the whole situation. He maybe shouldn't have touched your base. Sad, wound you multiple times. <laughs> All right, and does Piranha, Power Attack Piranha Strike? Can you choose to take it off? I don't believe so. Okay. Always, we've always done them as like you turn it on. It. It's just a thing. But okay. All right. Because I, I kind of want to hit on this last one, but that's fine. Uh, Did you take what? the mythic point? Uh, do you have mythic? AC uh, mythic. 21 is a miss on the last attack. It, it, so you must choose to make, use this before making the attack roll, and its effects last until your next turn. Okay, good. Yeah. All right, well, you tried. I tried, Ahmed. Do you, 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 do did you a have, good job. Do you have the mythic point to 10 rounds? No, yeah. George is oh, cool. George is coming. Let's go, George. Capra is coming. I want to keep George. You come as us, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh, Marty. Wait, What's so it? you're telling me that the bad guys they rolled a one and a two, or okay. they're okay. I understand. I, Dude, I that's understand. you can even go to the random numbers oh, and no, look I, at I the. I got you. Don't worry. Don't worry, Marty. I got you this time. <laughs> Just the way it is, just get your ass handed to you. Franco went first, man. Franco went first. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't worry. It's, so, it's okay. It's okay. I'm trying to figure out what to do with my spell. Well, it's your This guy has your turn to zero decide. ability. It's your turn. Now, I turned into, I used my shapeshifter ability. Is this, is this a full turn, right? Three actions? It's a full turn. Yeah, there was no surprise. So it's standard for me to you reacted to them trying to surprise you. So we might be able to take one guy out. But he's supposed to pummel you to death in very stylish fashion in a second here. Don't you want to be pummeled to death in a stylish fashion? <laughs> uh Quick Runner. Touch. Actually, yeah. So quick runner, pull the thing, pull the gun out. Faint the guy. He's got the gun out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I could probably step in and actually kill it out. You can, you can use a gun. There ain't no, there ain't uh, no shame in gunfire at the Alpha House. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a good idea. Step, so move in. I know he's going to take an AOO. Let him. Okay, you're, you're drawing the gun and you're moving. No, 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 draw, no gun draw. I'm moving. Okay. Uh. You are getting uh, sliced, <gasps> and he takes it. He'll take his AO for your movement. Yeah. Um, AC thirty six. <sighs> Yeah, that's a hit. Uh, how are you in fire? Uh, I don't know. Uh, could you let me know? <laughs> uh, well, I'm not a red dragon right now. 
No, no. Right now you are in. <laughs> I mean, that would, would be funny. Butler. <laughs> that would be funny. Uh, but yeah, no, I take fire. Okay. All right. So, uh, two pieces. Yeah, I don't see anything on your character sheet that helps you. Okay, 25 damage. Okay. As he clouds you. Okay. Uh, very, very horrible clouds. It feels. Bad. Uh, it's fiery and something else upon his his claws. Twenty five damage. Okay, uh, all right. It's not not this is not great, but all right. Look well, out for the claws, Butler. I've never met before. <laughs> uh, I'm actually going to. Can I step on top of this bastard right here or not? Yeah, uh, he's small, so you technically can't. Okay. You're, not, you're not combative. And we're flanking, so we're not like we're not up. No worries. We're gonna step here. We're going to thank him. Ooh. And he's already flat. Fo- he's already flat footed, right? He hasn't uh, moved yet. He's still, he's already, he's... He hasn't moved yet. He rolled yep. the trigger for the initiative or whatever. Yeah. Uh, okay, I'm going to faint him. Faint him like a man! Fra- Fra- Franco went first. <laughs> I'll faint him anyways, because I want to get him to lose his dex for you guys. 53, not 20. I could use that as an effect. Fuck my life. Okay. Uh, he won't get his dex back next round. Uh, no, attack. Oh, yeah. Okay, now you're going to attack him. Okay. So I moved. Swift. Uh, faint. Not swift, sorry. Another move is that. Then I'm going to quick draw my sword uh, with the with the okay. shirt runner, and then attack. Uh, how many shirt runners do you have? Two. Okay. I've used one before. Uh, the yeah, and this is the one I'm using now. Uh, I pull my blade out. Nine, twenty. Get him. Get him. Oh, uh, four, five, six. Get up. Nine. Uh, yeah, man. I don't know. Get up. We'll be five. Fuck. It's easy okay. twenty-eight. Yeah. Oh, is AC 28? Put him down. He's, he's AC 36 if he has his decks. <laughs> That's why we want to put him down before he... <laughs> put him down. Starts, be, starts being an asshole. Yep. He starts to be an asshole, yes. He's... All right. <laughs> and, he, and we establish he takes he fire. takes fire, yep. and he's, he's sneakable, right? He is sneakable. He will take fire. You're supposed to be my Kingsman guy who beats you to death with a cane. Fuck him up! Uh, 25. Ah, oh, shit. Look at this shit. Look at all these ones. Oh, oh. brutal, dude. What <laughs> a bunch of. Brutal. 25 man. damage. Uh, Alright, so one. 93. Alright, that's that. We're gonna have a hit point too bad. Oh, he's got ones. Okay, he's the mid. Okay. Uh, this guy's tough. Ali, who's getting his ass kicked from every direction. Uh, he's got haste, getting his ass handed to him. I think he likes you. <laughs> it was the. His name, the butler, turns around to the master and is like, I'll be right with you, my lord. <laughs> All right, so... This is the red opera. <laughs> just, just don't go pulling any ropes. <laughs> uh, so fucked. <laughs> so he is going to... So... Lois has a whole bunch of spells. He stabbed and did a bajillion damage. Um, <laughs> like a bajillion damage. <laughs> but the butler didn't really do too much damage, but he's corporeal. I know I can hit him. 
And then there's this ghost thing that's just like not at me. Uh, it's not great. All right, so he is going to. I believe fight defensively, and he's just going to attack. Well, this is the sub barest of of <laughs> <laughs> of situation. All right, who he did you going... choose? An old man. <laughs> he is going to attack Los with his. Primary and secondary attacks. He's going to then step out of the flank, and on his last attack, he's going to try to sunder the urn. Okay. Because if Ghost was hiding in the thing, screw your thing. That's the that's the thought process. Is he's wailing on you with a cane? All right. Uh, AC forty three. Uh, yeah. AC 31. 31 misses, but tags an image. So Los has seven images, so give me a D8. Two images gone. Okay. AC 28. Uh, misses. AC 37. AC 37, uh, D6. Image. An image. Okay, I've got four images left. Okay, he steps out of this horrific flank <laughs> for <Yep>. suckers. <laughs> Uh, and is going to attempt to summon another urn. <clears throat> Don't even know what happened. He's going to try to break your pot. He's breaking your pot. This is what he's trying to do. Yep. Uh, Don't know that he has the ability to actually harm it. Nobody could try. Yep. So he attacks it. He doesn't roll a one. He hits it. He does... Uh, 22 damage to the pot, doing no damage to the pot. Okay, so bef it's an adamantine-plated funerary urn before it became a minor artifact. The adamantine covering had hardness 20, 40 hit points, and the magical urn underneath is hardness 10 and 20 hit points. So, okay, so he, he, he scratches the... He the, scratched it before it became a minor... Uh, I, I, I guess the I guess the covering still has The covering damage. is not an artifact. Okay, right? yeah, so all right. he did do some damage. All right, so he did two damage. He did two damage to the earth. What the hell? You attack a man's home, will you? <laughs> <laughs> what did I ever do to you? He, he, he throws a... <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna age for this, buddy. You're gonna <laughs> age. <laughs> uh, all right. Uh, so. I've been watching a lot of Trailer Park Boys. This is Los's shed. <laughs> <laughs> He's got his kitty in there. <laughs> <laughs> kitty oh, funny. <laughs> uh oh. All right. So, all right. So, uh, Francine with the, we'll get to you next, Bright Eyes. He does not like being called Bright Eyes. He said it. <laughs> yeah, I I want Lois to absorb some of the some of the damage. I have it buffed. That's right. And whenever the group gets here, we're in a haste. <clears throat> well, you've got and uh, you've got a whole shit ton of spells on you. Think we're going to greater dispel you? Yeah, come on. Come on. Sorry for that, guys. They got crying little button. <laughs> Here, I'll organize them in order of their level. <sighs> Alright, so this will dispel up to... Uh, it's one per four or one per two? One per four. Okay, so this will dispel three spells. Okay, Los is a 10th level caster for, for his okay. for spells. <laughs> <laughs> I did not use any wands. I did not use any potions. <laughs> Fourth level magic ain't gonna do. Okay, uh, that didn't go well. And... Hey, did you use? Your, did you just use your butt trumpet? <laughs> Scowls. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> forward and stabs <laughs> the butler. <laughs> um, he 
<clears throat> stabbing of the butler. Uh, so it's the haste attack. AC 32 against the sod. I'll have a look. Sod without buffs is AC thirty. Okay, I'm right here, guys. You're AC thirty, right? You got, you got yeah, AC thirty. The, the spell magic did not take. I got stabbed. Yeah, uh, sixteen damage. All right. She cast a greater dispel, moved, and struck. Uh, they got hasted. So I will, sometimes during the blink that the, of Franco's turn, they all got hasted. Oh man! Don't right. just not go. <laughs> look at the look at the VZ for that party. Yeah, nice. <laughs> you can do it. <laughs> no, you can. I, I like how you're cheering on your own character. <laughs> hey, dude. Hi, right, Grippa. That's their attacks. All right, Grippa's gonna hop over here to provide a flanking companion for Los. Wait for Los to delay till Los gets there. Ah, uh, no, I I don't think he's that smart. In four. Uh, so for now he's just gonna hop. You know what? Los has to move anyways. Grip is gonna do a full round natural attack at at, at Ali at the highest base attack bonus. <laughs> uh, now. You greater fainted him last round? <clears throat> so he's five footed still? Yeah, he's okay. five footed right now. Okay. He's still all tangled up and confused. So AC twenty eight, <clears throat> AC thirty six. Okay. Um Arm Voraxes have bite and four claws. Okay. At and all of them are at the, the same bonus, which is sixteen plus heroism would be eighteen plus the rage is uh, 20. So here are five incoming attacks at plus 20. Uh, 20. Missed. Critical threat. Critical threat. And, it, and I don't know if you have a 19 crit range, but no. A critical, a potential critical and a hit. Okay. So we'll roll to confirm the crit. AC 33. Crit crit. Uh, Amazing critical, 1d4 to a random ability score, so it is uh, strength dex con. He takes three con damage. Bye-bye, shit for brace. And then <laughs> amazing crit instead of times two to be times three, so 3d4 plus six for normal damage plus six for piranha strike. No, he didn't piranha strike this time. He, he wanted to hit, so... Uh, so this is 18. Uh, uh, no, let's let's include the uh, it'd be 24 with the with the rage and 1d6 sneak attack. That looks right. So one of the claws hits for 36 damage. And then your regular attack. And then the regular attack, yeah. D four plus one D four plus eight plus one D six sneak. And fourteen damage for the regular attack. Okay, now when he goes unconscious, does he still keep clawing? Uh no, but he's gonna latch if it goes unconscious, he's going to grab. because uh, what he has grab on every single attack, so it's that last attack that he's gonna grab on or attempt to grab on. Okay, because after the crit he was unconscious. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, after the crit, he's unconscious? So yeah, he kept on attacking. Okay, he did. How right. mythic is these guys? I, no waste the mythic! I have, well, I haven't... We, this party, A, yeah, doesn't no, know they, that they yet. Know. Even Los doesn't know. It's like, how do we get more powerful? Don't know! Um, and he hasn't done anything with it, so we couldn't even... He stood there, got his ass handed to him for two yep. rounds. <laughs> All right, so the crit hit. He dropped in the crit, which means that Grippa took. 
Uh, it was a second attack. Oh, yeah. It, full round action. He basically launched on top of him and just sort of raked his throat open. Uh, you can delay till the sod goes and he can drop her, her uh, even greater faint her. Bright eyes next. <laughs> <laughs> the body doesn't move. <laughs> That's some scary shit. <laughs> yup. <laughs> We're just gonna go like this. Ah, his face melted. What's with all these melty face people? Goddamn. <laughs> <laughs> Side build up in here. <laughs> Okay, so far things are relatively quiet. No major evocation. Fireball. <laughs> Mort is running. Franco. Ah, oh, fuck. All right, we got a ghost. We got multiple ghost problems. An old man. Might be a plus three flaming demon sword, but hey. <laughs> What do we do? Cast Grease. Oh, on, the go on the ghost. <laughs> Slimer. Oh, come on, search engine. You can do it. I know you can. I had to go to Google for a few things. <clears throat> it's like their index is breaking. Come on. As a swift on. action, he is going to cast on death to death. No. <laughs> As a swift action. Fuck. Uh, hey. Who's, uh, who's he casting it? There's on? a potency and a power that exudes from him as he does this. Who's he casting it on? It's a circle. Oh, no. <laughs> no. How many okay. hit dice does he does he affect? 18d4. Roll low. 49 hit dice. Is there any max to the hit dice? Creatures of fused are hit first, slaves, living creatures, those plus the first point are written first. Mythic version of the spell, da da da. You spend two uses, also make advantage. Uh, if it's like Circle of Death, no creature. There's, of... a, there's, a, hit, there's a hit dice cap. I don't yep. think this will actually affect most. Okay, and Grippa has too many monster hit dice. Grippa actually has more hit dice than Lowe's does. It's a CR. It's not. It's every, like everything oh, else okay. we do, it's CR. All right. So grip is ninth. So grip of my, we have to incorporate later. Or the game. So circle of death says no creature nine or more hit dice can be affected. Oh, three nine or more. You're correct. He's a nine hit die creature. So he casts this spell to destroy the ghosts. The ghosts are not destroyed. But they are too potent. Whoa! Uh, but he did something pretty extreme. Yep. He's not happy. He spent one of his, one of his mythic points to do that. Uh, Butler, I didn't like the way that felt. <laughs> what else does he have to fight fucking ghosts? <laughs> Crease. Uh, <laughs> Crease. <laughs> We brought the right tools for this job, Ahmed. <laughs> There's not a lot in here for fighting ghosts. This kind of reminds me of the uh, the vampire adventure where none of us were humanoids. No, where no one was, like, nobody was humanoids. <laughs> all their powers were working. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> They're all monsters. We're all monks, too, so we're like, oh, no, no negative energy. <laughs> All right, so he's going to rip off a... This is where things might start to get loud. Yeah. Uh, he's not going to cast that indoors, because that's a little aggressive inside the opera house. 
but uh, he will attempt to make you go away through a empowered chain lightning. Okay. Fuck. All right. So that's he... not loud. Oh well, yes. I was gonna rock the shit out of the house. <laughs> it's not as loud as like a meteor swarm. <laughs> okay. Uh, he is firing the primary bolt at the blows. Sure. Because screw you. <laughs> Ghosty stick. Yeah, Los is a ninja, not a rogue, so he does not have yeah. evasion. I don't know if I don't know if Arcane Trickster eventually gives you evasion. I think there was some way where I was giggling about evasion, but uh... Uh, I think they get rogue talent, so they get improved evasion. <clears throat> ah, right. Uh, giggle. Um, but Los does have a decent reflex save. Okay. Uh, good hope helps, and not good hope. Sorry, uh, heroism helps. Heroism helps. Yep. All right, thirty-three. Thirty-three. 33? Cool. Alright, so... Um, okay, the spell creates blah, chain blah, uh, and then arcs to other targets. Primary target, one secondary target level, he's gonna hit uh, Grippa... And that's even letter. that's even if the primary makes their save? No, well, I think the primary makes their save, it is... Uh, they do, like, their save for half damage. Okay. Um, primary target, it strikes a number of targets <laughs> equal to blah. Each target's a reflex save, uh, for half damage, the reflex save is, is too lower, uh, uh, lower than half, uh, half DC uh, primary. Okay. Uh, so they actually they might take full damage, but they're DC, just the saving for DC lower. Okay. Uh, fuck me. Twenty one. Okay. Uh, so that Gosh. is seventy seven. Seventy seven uh, damage. Give me a second. The sods hurt. Tang. Sorry, 82. The sods really hurting right now. All right, so for the ghosts, they both made their save, so... Uh, it would be 80, it's like... 41, 20 damage? damage. Yeah. The sod needs to make a fort save or die. Three. What's the fort save to save and not die? Fifteen. Okay, three plus twelve is fifteen. We're alive. <laughs> I've been rolling monkey balls. All right. I've, I've been rolling monkey balls. <sighs> and he is readying an attack with his uh, haste attack. Oh! Hey, did doppelgangers uh, become ghosts? I don't have that many hit points left. The Opera House. Uh, people might have heard the chain lightning zap off. Oh, the chain lightning also blasts your urn. <laughs> because it's, like, it's one of the targets. <laughs> Screw your urn. <laughs> uh, it does like another two damage after you divide everything by it. Like, it yeah, uh, okay. So it's got four damage. It's good as if it should last through the Adamantine. Yeah, the Adamantine shell might get melted. Before it gets to the actual artifact of any. Uh, Alright, the uh, the Opera House, not certain. Nobody's kicked in the door yet. Blows. Wow, this, this guy is complete fuckery, but I think we need to end Bright Eyes before she starts dominating people. <laughs> so we'll move into here. She kind of thought her dominate work. Attack and attack and then ready in action for me to uh, drop her uh, dex. Uh, so he's got, so he's got, he's got two actions left. He can, he could spend a key point for an extra attack, but um, I think he might do that. Let's get to there first. So first, can she see Lowe's while invisible? Uh, she can see Lowe's while invisible, yes. Is she flankable and critable? Like, is, is she... she is flankable. Okay. She is critical. Lowe's is going to spend a mythic point to burn a fifth level spell to mage strike the woman. Such a 
You're such a goon. Eventually, the other mythic guy will show up and start doing mythic things. <laughs> uh, yeah, I, I need help here, guys. Yeah, well, we're trying, we're trying, dude. We're trying. I know, I know. <laughs> you might want to jump in the rope trick with the dead bodies. <laughs> yeah, the sod. Go run and there. climb up the rope is not a bad idea. <laughs> it's not. Hey, you're not it's looking too good there, Butler. <laughs> you're not you're looking good. too good. <laughs> All right, so 1d20 plus... 17 plus 2 for um, uh, hero, uh, heroism plus 2 for flank plus 10 for mage strike. Come on. AC 36. Uh, yeah. Okay. She takes precision damage. Yeah. And she takes sneak. Yeah. <laughs> Does she take fire? Uh, yeah. Blah, blah, blah. All right. So this is the first half of this, the first attack. Uh, does. Got everything? Yeah. 69. Okay. She <laughs> doesn't need to save or die. And then. No, this is also part of the same attack, so she needs to make a saving throw. Uh, DC 23 for half against 38 aging damage. Okay. Get wrinkly! You are the wrinkle beast. You wrinkle boss. So the right. total damage would be 90, 107 damage from that strike. Okay, she does have to save or die. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> she she ages and becomes pale and dies before you. Oh! She kept her hair, but it's not really hair. It's like flesh in the shape of hair. Okay, Lo sniffs it as she's going down. <laughs> <laughs> On guard! <laughs> and he yells on guard and faces Franco. So that was a move and a strike. And he's got one more strike. Okay. Which he's going to ready in case he casts a spell. Okay. Oh, yeah. No, first hey. I'm gonna first I'm gonna uh I actually want to hit him, so I could key strike for an extra attack and then ready the 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 last attack to disrupt the spell. But or I could just attack him twice. What do you think, Ovid? Attack him twice. Uh, ready. His spells are a problem. Yeah, my bonus to hit right now isn't that great. Like it would be plus plus sixteen. Ready to spend a key. A key gives you your maximum bonus, right? Is it just or is no. it just an extra hit, like haste? It's just an extra action. It's an extra attack in your yeah, attack. Yeah. He also has mirror images up that we need to bring down, so Lose is just going to start attacking. Uh, so uh, I I have less than twenty hit points. Yep. <laughs> AC thirty two. Uh, give me a second. Uh, that might hit. Uh, he's got seven images. One d eight. That's an image. We'll find you. And then I will spend a key point just for an extra attack because why not? Uh, EC twenty nine. That might do. That doesn't do. Pop damage. Yep. All right, that wasn't that wasn't a bad round. That was a pretty good round. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's pretty good. You're doing a good job. <laughs> Is this the guy with the funny hat? <laughs> yes, please don't kill him. Oh, okay, well, I'll try. <laughs> <laughs> More copper, where the fuck are you? <laughs> George, this guy, make way, please, make way, emergency. That's right, George. <laughs> That's right. Dasan? Uh-oh. Did the chocolate leave you guys any of the healing stuff? 
I've got some I've got some potions and I've got some wands. But no, when I'm using heal, I mean like the big Ow. heal. <laughs> oh, uh, I, uh it, 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 some of the potions might have been divvied. Give me a second. Who ended up with the potion of heal? I think it was Grackle. Was it Grackle? Check. Uh I have one heal scroll. Okay. I have the heal scroll. Thank you, Sonny. You're welcome. Yeah, I gave I you the I gave you the choice, Desaad or Grackle, and you you Grackle chose took yeah, Grackle came yeah. fast. Shit, okay. he took the potion. This is the time to use a scroll. Uh, Desaad's gonna pull out a scroll. Oh, Mord also has a potion of heal, so you know. Now I can't use this. You'll be dead through just AOE. <laughs> You you it's a six level spell, so you don't have six level sorcerer spells, and it's not the same. It's not a chain. I can't do it. Type. Yeah. So I just I just use I just, you burn it up. And I think doppelgangers just can use. I just cast spell trigger just use. Yeah. yeah. Okay, one action to pull the scroll. One, two actions to cast it. Yep. That is that puts me at what is it 110 points? Uh, I will be at 13 damage. That's cool. What's Errol doing here? Oh, do you did you you took Errol's form? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Just leave it. Whoa! I didn't like that either. Says Lois as this massive positive energy burst goes off. <laughs> Much better. Any arcane spell. How would I stop you from killing my ass? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and it might okay. And good. That's all I got. Okay. Yeah. Death to death is like the big honker. Yeah, we just got over the level. That was that was a concern. Oof. <laughs> 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 Yikes. Oh, Al Ali's dead, and uh, Francine is dead. Well, they're dead-ish. You know, their initiatives don't matter anymore. It's well, don't matter. <clears throat> around to save them, don't worry. Well, the way, sorry, well, the Ali's dead. Yeah, Ali, Ali is dead. Yeah, nobody's saved this stupid ass. Francine, though, he might come back. Grippa. <laughs> How you doing, boy? Oh, is that right? <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, this is the bite. Uh, flankable? Uh, yes, flankable. Okay. And I think he just wants to latch on so he won't uh, piranha strike. Okay. AC 35. Actual hit. All right, D6. D6. Uh, it's an image. Okay. Next attack is a claw. AC 33. It's five. It's an image. Uh, that's his turn. Mort arrives! Motherfucking Mort! <laughs> uh, <clears throat> I can't. All time stop cannot use light. I can't heal the three times. Alright. Okay. Uh. Oh! Mort! So, Mort's movement rate when he has wings. Give me a second. Fly as per fly spell. So, Mort instead of. Is Capra. Capra and Mort is yeah, so Mort's going to drink his mutagen and move this round. Okay. So this, is, this is when they arrive. So, what he's saying is Mort has his mutagen running. And he's like, 
not in the room yet. Yeah. Next round, he'll be with mutagen, ready to kick ass. Yep. I'm coming! All right. Franco. All right. One minute. <laughs> what is the big go-away necromancy of immune to undead spell? I mean, <clears throat> clerics get one, but do wizards get one? One that he wouldn't have to freaking learn. Hey, is this guy a candle person too? Uh, what? Well, they, they, what? They all, all their faces melt. Yes, he's one as well. Oh, no. Make sure you don't kill him, though. Oh, don't worry. <laughs> you are turning out to be the great sword. I think about <laughs> you cannot laugh. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like gank, good. gank. <laughs> All right. Great undead orange will be <laughs> the burn a. So it's expensive. Mythic point to burn a spell. Burn a spell. <laughs> yeah. 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 Oh yeah, yeah. He's dumping a lot. He's dumping it all into the thing. Oh, he wants. He wants to help sod out. He's having fun. <clears throat> okay. So, as a swift action, he is going to cast a spell, which brings Francine back to life. Okay. Does he have to make a no. concentration check at all, or? Uh, it's a swift. Yeah, so I think he's good. Yeah. Uh, so, he did something that made a breath of life appear. Well, how much does uh, Breath of Life? 5d8 plus 18. Just like that. Yeah, yeah, but how much? 45 healing. Damn. I know what I'm doing next round. <laughs> but she's prone, <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. She is prone, yeah. She's on the ground prone. Yeah, might as well faint her as well. <laughs> Start kicking her in the ribs? <laughs> Uh, okay, so that was swift, and then as a standard, what are we going to do? This is so shit. <laughs> <laughs> this didn't go at all how I was hoping it would go. Um, uh, hey, no coming back to life. <laughs> Stop that, cheater. Right, you, says, you the go the says, says the ghost. <laughs> says the ghost. <clears throat> He's going to concentrate to uh, he can blow up the room super good. Did he just try to do that again? I don't think so. He will attempt to slow everybody. Is that correct? That's like stupid. Okay, if he's doing it defensively, the difficulty is too too, too higher, higher than normal. Cause, yeah, because of Grippa. Okay, so he's going to do this defensively. He's also going to do this heightened. Uh, actually, no. He doesn't have enough actions to do it heightened. That sucks. All right, he's just going to attempt to resilient spear most because that will solve this problem at least temporarily. Yep. Uh, he will cast it defensively. He makes a check automatically. He makes a six level spell check automatically, basically. Oh no, it's that wouldn't be. It's just too high or not double. Okay. So DC twenty three twenty five concentration plus twenty five. Okay. Get in the get in the fucking spear, you bastard! All right, so Los needs to make a. <laughs> Los needs to make a reflex save. I'm going to burn a panache point to do a charmed life. Hey, get the goddamn sphere! <laughs> Stab me all the time, Stab all my friends. All right, so Los's reflex save is plus twenty, plus two for heroism, and then charmed life adds how much? Charisma. Is it your charisma? I think so. Charmed life, three per day, plus your charisma. Ooh, Nelly. Okay. 
let me just take all this stuff off before I forget. So one of those, one of the panaches, and plus eight. 37. Okay, which spot do you want to be in that's not the one you're currently in? Because there's now a sphere there that you're not in. Unless you want to be in the sphere. Nope. That's fine. <laughs> I'll be in that one. Okay. I will draw a sphere there. This guy likes blowing bubbles. <laughs> uh, are they able to take his haste attack in case you and Grip on his screen again? <laughs> yep, the cat's got mage armor up. Um, that's about it. Its AC is pretty low. <clears throat> Thirty-nine. Yeah, you hit. Uh, all right, so two D. It takes evil damage, right? I would take evil damage. I don't see any reason why it wouldn't. Uh, and then fire damage. I think works. Uh, no, the base creature has resist fire ten, so I don't know. <laughs> okay, not enough fire damage. <laughs> not enough fire damage. Uh, so ten damage after the uh, divide by two. Yep. So that's thirty hit points. Grippa has. Um, 172 hit points, so... Uh, <laughs> that's way more than the sword! Yeah, I guess that's hit points. <laughs> what the hell is this charisma? <laughs> its charisma is 20. It's got 12 racial hit dice plus the one class level. What was level. the base charisma? Uh, the base charisma was 11, but heroic increases by 4, and ghost gives a, a template of 4, and then level, I gave it 1 to round it out. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. 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 Wow. Okay. Okay, ghost boy. He's way you as a ghost. Yeah. <laughs> you know, he he doesn't get his grapple off as often, which is four rakes <laughs> if you start a start a yeah. grapple with the uh, the thing. All right, that's Franco trying to not die in the opera house. Uh, oh. There's been a couple of exploding spells, but not too much. Los, what you doing, my man? Is Los's turn already? Yeah. Hmm. Everybody else is dead. <laughs> stab, 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 stab. Retreat to your urn and contemplate your actions. Now, Los is going to... Does he delay until after Grippa? <laughs> Good. Get the hell over there. <laughs> like talking is a free action. It's yeah. hard to understand yeah. talking. Um basically we we still we would both still be going before Ah, oh, but she's down. She I mean she's active again. I'll 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 focus on her. You you'll get her? Well, if I roll like a human being. Not like a curse song, but it's What was the rule about true striking with your eyes closed? You have to have your eyes closed for the whole round. Okay. You don't toggle your eyes. Your I'm eyes getting, are like... I'm getting hit anyway, so... Yeah. But if you target the right square, there's no mischance. Like, it, it does bypass your mirror images, but you have to close your eyes, meaning you're flat-footed on your turn. How many mirror images does she have? He has three. She. No, uh, she doesn't have any mirror images. <clears throat> hmm. You might want to get grip at that tag. Eat up those mirror images. She gets to, she gets to act before. She's gonna get to blow you up. But yeah. I get to act before her. Yep. Or dominate you or people mind you. I need to do forty five damage or so. Okay, so Los is gonna delay until after Desaad, and he'll continue delaying <laughs> depending on how the turn is going. <laughs> <laughs> so I'll move him down initiative to uh, uh, basically twelve. Los is having a look around. All right, George. Hey, George is running and he's at the door. Put up your sign, George! Says Lois. 
<laughs> uh, George George hasn't he's only heard Los once. Unless George is awesome and he can just see everything. But he can he, quite see he, everything. Is he looking into the yeah, he's not looking into the room? He's not at the he's basically outside. He open the door, side. open the door, let the guys in, George. <laughs> So he's having a Capra. Okay, Capra. I think Capra is going to say, "Screw the mutagen." <laughs> uh, so he's not going to drink the mutagen. He's just going to get to the door, and he's so he gets to the door, opens the door, has one action left. Uh, shoot the damned lady. <laughs> don't that... think I don't think while standing in the hallway, he's going to start shooting people in the room <laughs> in the middle of the opera house during break time where everybody's in the hall. No, no. Trying to get Bar- can you Bart's on? Can you go and stand on top of her? Uh, yeah, I think Bar- Bart's on might be a good thing. Yep. Okay, Capra is going to he's going to open the door just a little bit so the door's unlatched. He's ready to you know it's it's openish. Uh, and he is going to give a, uh, hey, you were the champion. <laughs> he's, he's, he's doing a really shitty rendition of, of what he just heard during the summer hey, part of the play. <laughs> we will grow and we will not be awesome every day. <laughs> oh, shut we the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Music to my ears, Capra. These two are are wax people. Get them. Hopefully, <laughs> that's it. All right, it's fainter. Well, she's currently flat-footed right now. All uh, right, she's prone. She was unconscious, she and now she woke up. Does she get to just resume? Uh, no, she, she's flat footed until she has an action. Yeah, yeah. yeah first right. to go back. Yeah. <clears throat> so she's flat footed. Mm-hmm. And from. Wow. Wait a minute. Sec. Bard Song's wrong. Plus two Bard Song or plus three? Uh, Capra has a hit dice from another thing. Oh, that's too bad. Griffin is a Capra song. <laughs> God damn it, Kitty! It's like a puppy. It's like a puppy cat. Not even sure what the hell that is. It's got real Ripley muscles. Wow, it's twenty-five hitter. It hits her prone. I plant wood. So she's, she's, she's sneakable, right? Uh, in this configuration, yes. AKA ass kick on the ground. <laughs> and she took fire. 39. Yeah, it's better. Is that damage or? Damage, yeah. Okay. You're including Bard's song in there? No, I'm not. Uh, so, two more to hit? Yep. 41. <clears throat> she's still up? Uh, yes, yes, she's still up. Or if I up, I mean down. But you know what I mean. She's, she, she's there. She's, her eyes she's are alive. Open. She's still awake. Okay. She actually has some spells to deal with low, so she wants her turn. <laughs> <laughs> wow, look at my rolling! Does 20 hit her? No. No. Okay, so four, two, two. Yeah, you're playing Star Wars right now. The rest of us are playing D20. <laughs> oh, fuck. Apparently. It's because you're dressed up like the butler. <laughs> oh, shit. I can't afford to, to take two actions to it. Well, I could have just now, apparently. <laughs> 
Yeah, I'm, I'm done. There's nothing else I got. Okay, so uh, Los? Yeah, I did. Capra doesn't have the finales. Los will take the AOO as he flies over. Okay, uh, Franco will take the AOO. Screw you, bud. Repost. Yeah, it's, it yeah I'm going to repost, yeah. AC 34. Uh, Los's AC is 34 with the shield spell. And oh, I've I've got a bunch of images, but I'm reposting it. Anyways, so yes, don't stab me, bro. <laughs> AC forty three, so I repost. Okay. Then Put this claw out of the way. Yeah, and then I'll attack back. Uh, so that burned the panache, and then put the attack back. 1d20 plus 20 to hit, plus 2 for heroism, plus 2 for bardsong, which do stack competence and morale. Uh, he can see me. There is no flank, so... AC 31. D4 images, or D4 from images. Pops an image. Okay. Two more images. Left. Worth. Okay, so that was a fly to get over there. One, two. <laughs> All right, this lady needs to die. So Los is going to burn a mythic point to burn a fifth level spell. This is his third fifth level and spell. You won't do it. Go back. We've got this room book going. <gasps> Los. <laughs> We're just rousing for play. Go away. <laughs> 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 All right, 17 plus 4 for the buffs, plus 10 for the mage strike. So expensive. Uh, I think that's it. AC 33 with a 2. Welcome to my world. <laughs> In her compromised position, that hits. Nice. 2d4 plus 17. Try to breath of life that. <laughs> plus 10d6 plus 4d6 sneak. She takes 7. She makes her fart save versus the, the aging. Okay, so she takes 70 damage plus the aging, which would be 11d6. Uh, uh -oh. Uh, she takes a hundred and oh, sorry, half of that, so eighteen. She takes eighty-eight damage total from all of it. Okay. Uh, she needs to make a fort save or die. She doesn't die outright, but she's unconscious. Okay. She's also bleeding. If she is immune to that, or uh, give me a second. Other guy was going to do it. I don't think she is. She. No, oh, she bleeds real good. <laughs> okay, so she's got four bleed, which will happen next next turn. So that, that was Lois moving and stabbing. Wait a minute. Did I hit her already? I hit her, right? She's uh, bleeding. Oh, well, she, she's got different. How much bleed do you do? Uh, mine stacks. Every time I hit her, it keeps stacking with my own hits. I don't know if it's actually right, so this, this is more it's a wound. It, it's a okay. wound. Okay. All right. So that was a move and an attack, and then Los is going to attack her while she's down. You going to attack who? I'm going to attack her while she's down. Okay. <laughs> so <laughs> uh, this is plus 19. Uh, AC 27. Hit. Uh, yeah. Okay. She takes another... Oh, Bard Song. Uh, 43 points of damage. Very good. You're just torturing her, bud! back into the previous. Okay. He Los will burn a key point. 
from his ninja pool to get his last attack on Franco. Because we just got to burn some of those images. Oh my god, stop it. Stop it. This, this, this is plus 14. Yeah. AC 23. Is that within five? Eventually hits. Oh. Franco's a wizard or something. <laughs> <laughs> He's a wizard. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Franco, uh, not the uh, big fighty man. He has uh, big fighty friends. Hey, Capra! <laughs> I am. We're busy! <laughs> All right, Franco's got one image left. It's Franco's turn. Uh, it is Grippa's turn. <laughs> 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 All right, so. No, no, stay oh, no. there. Stay there, Grippa. <laughs> Grippa's gonna do all. Grippa's gonna do all the attacks. Okay, never mind. Grippa's just gonna attack. Oh, Grippa's ghost. Okay, so the base attack is plus sixteen when it's raging and heroism and bard song. It's plus twenty twos. Should I take the? I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna cross strike. We're gonna start to try to do damage. Okay. Uh, so that's five at plus one nineteen. Twenty-three, twenty-three, twenty-six, twenty-seven, and thirty-one. All right. So the first one goes to an image. Then the rest all hits. Hey, does he have any DR or anything like that? DR and adamantum. Uh, okay. good thing I piranha strike. So, I'm going to do these individually, I think. So, you said four hits? Uh, yes. So, 1d4. So, these would be 1d4 plus 14 minus 10. So, 1d4 plus 4. So, I can roll them yeah, all together. 4d4 plus 16 damage. Uh, 27 damage total. <clears throat> okay. Images. Ooh, grapple. Oh, and then the grapple attempt on the last one. Yeah. Can you grapple on? Can you grapple on every attack? No, I I don't. Grapple on, on a different one. It stops our the routine. Yeah. Hmm. Art song and Thirty-four on the grapple. Second. Be highly embarrassing for him for a second here. Uh, e and B. Show me your C and B. The ghost thing latches onto his leg. <laughs> he gets grabbed by a ghost kitty. He tears the shit out of him. He's well, very close, but you got grabbed by a ghost kitty. All right. So if I start the turn, if Grippa starts his turn and he's still grappling, he then gets to get four rake attacks off and. They're basically four more claws. This is a problem. <laughs> uh, more. What do you ask me? Comes flying into the room and comes in. Turns big. Yeah. How many actions is turning big? Two. Actions. That would be all so of his turn. Big, that's it. Yeah. Uh, I would say twice. Those are your options. Hmm. Yeah, sure. That wasn't either or. Got a yeah, sure. You're paired with two options option A and option B. Um, <laughs> Turn big or come in and attack. Yeah, do the attack. Come in and do the attack. Okay. And then next round. Actually, come in and ready to attack him if he's casting. Ready to disrupt the spellcast. Mm -hmm. All right. <laughs> this guy, he's grabbed. His friends are dead.
What's how good of a grappler is short round there? Uh, short round, so 10 plus 9 bab. It's 19. Plus 5 dex, minus 5 strength. They kind of cancel each other out. Yep. Minus 1 size, plus 5 charisma, because charisma for ghosts is deflection. Is there deflection bonus? Yep. So that comes up to 23. Now, it has grab, which is a plus 4 to maintaining any grapples. And it has improved grapple. Does that add to the CMD as well? Yeah, it adds to the maintaining part of grapples, which is your CMD. <clears throat> and then plus two for a feat. So we're at 29 grapple. Okay, so does he want to make concentration checks and cast verbal spells while he's in grapple? They would be at plus two, two, two DC higher because of Grippa. They would be. <laughs> and they start at 29. Okay, he's going to it first. Okay, he's attempting to cast a spell. Okay. Um, I think that triggers the ready to action from Mort. Yep. Okay, so he's attempting to cast a spell. So power attack mutagen plus 23. Power attack mutagen, yeah, plus 23. Bard song would be plus 25. Uh, 30... Uh, four. Hit. Oh, yeah. Okay, so that. 1d plus 27 plus... Does he take acid, electricity, fire? He... Yeah, all three of those elements. He prepared, he protected, he was there fighting to code a cold the crap out of this room. Because <laughs> they all had that spell. <laughs> so he's protected against all that. Okay. Uh, he's not, and then, oh, not not. He does, he does everything he wasn't protected. Oh, against. oh, I see. I see what you mean. Uh, Isn't it sneak? Where's his sneak? His sneak is forty six. Is he sneakable? He is sneakable. He does have adamant time No, oh, this is a abyssal steel. So let's get to that. Fifty eight damage. Becomes forty eight. Forty eight. Yeah. Sorry. Okay, his standard action spell is disrupted. He's going to attempt to cast again as a swift action. This is all going to shit. He's going to burn a, he's going to do this uh, quickened as opposed to trying to do it um, uh, Mythic. He's using a lower level spell quickened as opposed to a higher level spell. And yep. To... yep. Uh, he has to make a roll against Grippa. Okay, I'll just add the two to this. So it's CMD plus spell level? It's it's CMD plus spell level. What's the, to level. What's the total level of the spell he's trying to cast? Uh, when it's quickened, does that impact the concentration check? I th think... It's either a ninth or a fifth. I think because it's I think it's a ninth to get it off for this for this effect I think it's a ninth yep. in that case. Okay, so Grippa's base CMD for grapple is twenty nine plus two for his little power there. Uh, yep. Oh wait a second, wait one second. He is raging. That increases his dex, which increases his CMD. So uh, that's a total. Well, it, also, it reduces his. It gives him a penalty to AC, which reduces. His CMD. No, no. Uh, uh, urban CMD. barbarians don't get any penalty AC, and they don't get any uh, bonuses. Urban barbarians to... are barbarians. Or, the, or yes. they don't get any bonuses to will saves. So uh, what um, about Bart song? Th no, it doesn't. So thirty-three plus whatever the spell shit. Okay. Is the concentration check? He does not teleport to the lodestone in the center of the city. <laughs> he was trying to teleport away. He tried twice. To just go anywhere other than here. Oh, this guy's trying to get out of here, I think. You, you tell him, Grippa. <laughs> there we go, Grippa. <laughs> fuck now. Franco is trying really hard. The Opera House. What's going on in there? There's some people outside that are being nosy. George. 
Pardon me, excuse me. Out of out of service. <laughs> I'm I'm sorry. We'd be ple- we'd be pleased to take your business to. The- <laughs> there are many others who will help you when you. <laughs> Uh, he's trying to basically get the crowd away from the door where there's this really big thing else. What the hell? <laughs> it's just a rabbit dog. <laughs> Capra, Capra is going to fully enter the room. Uh, George closes the door at that point. <laughs> Into flanking position, fully enter the room. <laughs> he's going to pull out his bow and he's going to. Uh, you sleepy ones, right? Yeah, tag him with yeah. one of the beanbags. Yeah, skip him. Al- yes, please keep him alive, sir. All right, we're going to. He looks pretty easy to hit. He's grabbing stuff. Uh, I think I have to use magic. I don't think. Here's a second. He's immune uh, to sleep. Sorry. The... Don't try the sleep. Just try to knock him out. Please. Uh, no, the blunt arrows do bludgeoning damage, but they're not non-lethal apparently. I have to use the magic arrows for that. Which is fine. He's gonna wail on him with merciful arrows. We will use two merciful arrows. He'll get a little bit of real damage in there too. It's a big boy. Uh, Alright. 27. Uh, with Bard Song and the thingy, it becomes 30. 32 with a flank. Uh, becomes 30, becomes 27. Hits. And hits. The non-lethal will be 2d8. Plus this is where this guy has a bad day. Uh, it's only 4d6 plus 2d6 for Merciful plus uh, the deadly aim uh, both times. Uh, okay. He takes 65 non-lethal, and uh, plus 2d6, plus uh, 23 lethal, because my god the dead. <laughs> um, oh, sorry, I missed Bart's on it. Um, Another four. Uh, it's actually six more non-lethal and uh, three more lethal. Because I missed Bardsong and Point Blank by that. Okay, so... Uh, uh, your arrows tickle when they go through me. Yeah, you just stand still. Just stand still there, bud. Um, 65. Seven, there's 71 non-lethal. And he has exactly 100 lethal. 100 lethal, 71 non-lethal. How many hit points you got? Here, buddy guy. A double wizard. Okay, he's still moving. He is bloodied. Um, okay, that's Capra. He gets pretty good. And then there was the harvest buddy and the thing with the sun and all. Sod's casting Dimensional Anchor. On this guy. Okay, you have to make an attack roll, I think. Okay. I think it's a it's a pew pew. Uh is it pew pew? Yeah. Uh, is it touch? It is touch. Okay, so that's good. Let's see, let's see. 11, stubble, 15, 17. Whew, 31. Gotcha. Hey, you, you touch him? He does not have SR. That's all my actions. A lot of scroll, use the best one. Okay. The, 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 yeah, oh, no. You're not going anywhere anymore. There's Los. He's got a nice hit point buffer on <laughs> Keep him alive. Well, if he's not knocked out with 100 death. 
damage. <laughs> and Los does approximately 100 damage with his crazy swing. Yeah, let's let's do this. We need to put it. Got to be safe, don't you, bud? <laughs> don't kill him. <laughs> no, no, he got he got being bagged. <laughs> we don't want this guy casting any more spells, dude. He's he's enough out of yeah, him. Dude. Enough out of him. He's whipping out knights like crazy. Okay, Los spending his last mythic point for the day. He is burning his last fifth level spell for the day because Wall of Force isn't really going to work and it's not really needed in this place. <laughs> now, if we crit, this is going to be bad. <laughs> you might not want to confirm. Yeah. Or you might want to and see what happens. <laughs> Bard song. <laughs> trying to size you up. <laughs> Bard song. Um, heroism flank with Mort. Critical threat. Okay, it is. What do you want me to do? Uh, you could kill him. I don't know. Uh, it's it's up to Los. Los has two actions after this. If I kill him, can Los... Spe it's a ghost touch blade he's got. Can he spend his last two actions to kind of... Needs to be killed with something specific. I need to kill him with the crown. With the crown. Okay. So you're saying don't confirm this? <clears throat> you're supposed to assassinate him. <laughs> assassination. <laughs> oh, you were there. Mark and I were making hat butts for that. <laughs> assassination. <laughs> assassination. <laughs> All right, fine. I won't. <laughs> <laughs> I know you want to. <laughs> I would do. Wow, it's still going to be a ridiculous amount of damage. So here's the. I still have to make a fort save for time. That's still gonna happen. Here's the thing. mage strike plus the sneak attack plus my piranha strike is 66 points of damage. Is that four after DR? Uh, mage strike, I think it's through all DR. Give me a second. Uh, yes, it does. Yes, it does. <laughs> Yeah, bypasses all damage reduction. Energy resistance still applies. Uh, and then the 11d6 DC 23 fort save versus the aging damage. And he makes a save on the aging damage? Okay, he takes 17 damage. Okay. So the total was 70, 80... Three damage on the strike. He is unconscious. Yep. He doesn't have to make a fortitude save or die because of the non lethal. Nice. Oh, I, is, are you sure? It's like the sword is still in him. <laughs> are you sure? A flick of the wrist, it'd be all over. Uh... Oops. Oops. <laughs> Here we go. What do I gotta tell you? What I gotta repeat my fucking self here again? Ah, uh, yeah, out of. I downed all three foes. <laughs> you too, Grippa. You just hold on to him just in case he wakes up. Don't you squeeze. I got this. Um. <clears throat> continue. Or do you want to jump out or? Uh, we could wrap this up real quick if you like. Yep. Mort, Mort's just going to go over, thanks, George, and closes the door. For <laughs> me a moment. Oh, uh, guys, guys, it's starting to hit. <laughs> <laughs> Inside the door. No. 
Hold on a second. Uh, Mort, to scare people away, is going to pull down his pants a little bit and just let the diarrhea fly. <laughs> In the room or outside? Outside the room. The room. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Um, there's calls for a bucket. There's a... <laughs> what are you doing? Mort's going to create a distraction. Dirty bird. All right, we got you. We got you, bud. <laughs> while, while he's doing this, uh, Builder's grabbing the uh, crown. I'm Maybe. sorry, Jarth. We shouldn't have had that milk. <laughs> I'm going to lean, lean on it with my weight on top of his... Understandable, like, gentlemen. Understandable. Throat and chest. Okay, you, you pull the crown. The crown has immediate weight and power as you pull. It doesn't seem to want to initially detach from Franco's skull as you're pulling. Get off of that fucking head. And as you're pulling it off, you seem to like pull Franco with it, leaving behind the potent looking doppelganger underneath, who is also unconscious. Be there. It's <laughs> blood trickling out of his skull. Fucking piece of shit. <laughs> Yeah, suffer, you bastard. <laughs> hey, very, very gruesomely starts hitting that thing and just pushing it into his chest. You take the crown and you thrust it into this being's chest. Grippalus. Your yeah, hands, as you're pushing, melt into the crown. And the crown becomes one with your person. Power flows through you, as do does the memories of a kingdom of doppelgangers not really it's like this weird this kingdom of thieves we have a culture what's your culture we took every other culture and made it our culture <laughs> so it's like a, almost a borg like mentality of everything is us mm. power from this being flows within you this crown melds to your personage and you know that you are a king among doppelgangers you are a rightful controller of them, and that you have control over them if you want to exert it. Additionally, the, the Doppel Crown acts as if you have a as two powers uh, initially. The it's not slotless, correct? Uh, it is, it, so it is, would be in the equivalent of your tattoo slot for your, your, uh, head, head, it's your tattoo head slot. So the doppel crown, as well as the bearer of the doppel crown acts as if they have a mind blank on for the sake of detect evil, locate creature, scry, and truce so for anything so that would seeing does what? So, anything that would see through your disguise. Your magical disguises are effectively not magical. You need mythic magic to see through a your disguise at this point. When you when you transform. The other aspect of the doppel crown. The doppel crown, once every mythic level, you get to add one of those feats that you're using in your feat train. You can use the we get, we get one mythic, one feat per, per mythic cure that you get for those different effects to free up some, some feat slots. And the Dropple Crown is only possible, possibly visible by doppelgangers. All other creature types cannot see it in any way, shape, or form. There's probably a mythic spell out there that allow them to see it, probably a mythic true seeing. But anything beyond ma magic of that level, it doesn't exist. There are so other they can items see of doppel crap. If I let them, or if I touch them, or... People watched you bludgeon the man to death with your hands, and he bled a lot in ways that didn't make sense. They can't see it. No, no, they but can't. I saw it only when he touched me. Yes. So even if... So other dopplers can't see it unless I touch them? Or they touch you. How do I exert my power on other doppel doppelgangers? When you're in contact, you do it through charisma checks. Got a 
increase my charisma wise. <laughs> so if you're making physical contact with another doppelganger, you're effectively like they're under a charm. Effectively, they can you can assert your will over them just through force of charisma. Okay, and you were saying that every level of mythic, I can move one of my feet or pick a new one. But it'll give you forms. Like it'll they take up some of those form slots so you can grab a couple of feet. Fuck yeah. You have blood in the Doppel King, long live the Doppel King. Hey, uh, when you're done staring at that dude, uh, you wanna you wanna loot? Hey Capra. Pick this thing up. What are you ah. mooks doing? Steal all the shit. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> are, are they still here? Somewhere. Are they still here? Or are they... The other two have disappeared. Disappeared, disappeared. Uh, this one did not disappear. What happens when a doppelganger tries to steal the power of another doppelganger? Piece of him? Um. Uh, do you have Shape Changer in your repertoire? Mm hmm. Do you, you took a feast to turn into a Shape Changer? Uh. N no, 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 sorry. That, that, I don't need a feat for that. It's just in my. I don't think doppelgangers can turn into other doppelgangers because a doppelganger isn't an alter self. You need to add the class type, like werewolf would be in that one as well. Do you have the type shape changer in the list of things that you can shape change into? No. Yes. I don't believe the answer is yes. You'd be interested. You can if, take a piece of this guy if you want. If you like his body so much, just roll him up in the tapestry. <laughs> There's a tapestry in this room, right? Uh, yeah, there's a tapestry that the the rope trick is that's holding the other bodies so <laughs> he's hiding behind. We'll just roll them up and take them. Hey, can we uh, shadow walk from here to the train? Uh, we could probably just leave. I we don't. I don't really care that much about them. Just take a piece of them, chop his head off. Actually, we don't want to leave doppelganger shit here. God, How much gold did these guys have? George is getting a hell of a payday. <laughs> God, uh, Roll right. him up in the carpet. Let's go. Uh, uh, they, uh, in cash, they were holding at least... Uh, it was over 4,000 gold pieces just in point of view. Okay, so I, I believe 300 is good for George. Take his body. We could do stuff with it. Context. <laughs> we could speak with dead. We could do blood biography. We could stick him in a tank and study him. Hey, look at this fucking guy. What the hell are these bumpy things on his head? You don't have bumpy things like that. The other one's doing bumpy things no, like that. No, this guy's pretty goddamn up. He's a piece of shit, is what he is. Kicks him. <laughs> do you have... So how do you kill him with your bare hands without touching him? Oh, you know, yes. doppelgangers can make their fingers into knives. But you're supposed to be a hat assassination. Where is he? He's not a hat assassin yet. Yeah, you can't see it. It's gone. Okay. Let's get out of here. Okay. Um, how do we deal with this guy? Where can we put him? Um, you can wanna... hear people outside. There's a bunch of people cleaning up a pile of nasty oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, oh, yeah. Um, um, prestigitate. Clean up all this crap. Okay. The, uh, the, the two that... Uh, Violently discorporated upon the like, confirmation of the death, aka two rounds later, um, uh, 
They didn't leave any blood behind. There is but my blood. mess from the doppelganger. My blood. Oh yeah, you're bleeding all over the place. <laughs> no, no, I'm 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 good. I, I'm, At one yeah. point you were bleeding all over the place. Yeah, yeah. So I'm cleaning that shit up. It was turning into yep. sludgy. Yep. Um, how can we get this guy? <sighs> you can hear the sounds of the third act just, starting. Just roll him into the carpet. Uh, what act were we supposed to be out of here by? The end of the third. Or the end of the third. Let's wait until the third act starts. Hey, wait till the third act starts and we just get the hell out of here. Roll him off on the carpet. It'll be fine. Yeah, you want to just walk out the front door with a body in a carpet. You can't bang into what do you mean? Just put him in the put him in the bag. You might fit. Does he would he fit in a in a uh what's it called? Bag of holding type two. Yeah. We empty the bag first and then I have okay, a bag type of... two content limit is five hundred pounds. Yeah, we empty the bag first, put them in, and then make sure we're not overloading the bag. Okay. Hey, you throw me the bag. You throw me the bag of holding. <laughs> uh, I'll just ensure that it's on the sheet. I don't think it's actually. Can you give me the details of the crown? Let's do that offline, guys. Let's end. Up. Yeah, yeah, no, no. I mean, like, in a, if you, I sounded like you were reading it, so if you have a. I'll, I'll I'll give you a write up. I I detailed it before, but I detailed it all too much. I okay, I power. All right. Ask, ask, got cool funk crown. It was ugly as fuck, but cool. All right, I gave you enough. I gave you as much uh, much as I got in me. <laughs> oh, it is plenty, sir. <laughs> I'm not talking to you, George. So good job, though. Uh, let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Hey, um, George, come here for a sec. You're a good guy. You, I like you. I like you. You're taking care of your kids, huh? Little Susie. Little... I'll take care of her, huh? She's a good oh, girl. Of course, sir. Your wife and everything. Huh? She's a cute wife. Make sure she happy. Buy some nice. That I will, sir. She's 300 gold. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. I would stay the fuck out of this room for a while. We get real bad. <laughs> stay, take tomorrow off. <laughs> Road trip. <laughs> How did they miss this shit? <laughs> Understood, sir. Yeah, you're a good sport. Like you said. Uh, we have, have a nice, a, have a nice so, evening, gentlemen. Hey, Georgie, can you uh, can you show us an easy way out of here? Actually, we're not carrying a body. Hey, George, we're gonna we're gonna take the rest of the day off. We're a little tight, you know what I mean? A little fucked up in the elbows. Shit. Is there anything you need for the road, gentlemen? <laughs> now nah, we're good. Nah, nah, nah. I think we're good. Yeah, but what we're gonna do is that out. We'll go. Uh... What happens in the, What happens in the rest of the story? Damn. Get a chance to see it again. It's just about fairies. Captain, we're getting out of here. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> and we get your shit and let's go. Okay, George's going to open the door for you. Uh, you can hear the, the Wait, he said he's leaving. Paul. He said he's leaving at 8.30, right? No, matter. He's not leaving before then? He's leaving at 8.35? Exactly. All right, let's, uh, we, 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 we can't miss this. We got to go. Get out. You make your way out of the building. Okay. It's a little bit of winding. Mort will tip George 10 gold pieces. So George has been given 310 gold pieces and one cup. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You did a good job there, George. I always tip at the end. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Yeah. Have a lovely evening. Yeah, we're yeah, you, you too, buddy. Gonna go watch the horse races. Morris just making shit up at this point. Come on, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Get in the goddamn horse carriage. Get the fuck away. <laughs> <laughs>
you make your way out, you do have to go through a security check on the way out. It's really minor compared to the security check on the way in. <laughs> they could check my check my disguise now, you still bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. As you're crossing the street and entering the carriage with uh, with which uh, Savani is in, you hear the sound of a massive explosion from within the uh, from within the opera house. Oh. Out of here, boss. <laughs> uh, we need that. Uh, no. Uh, I pray for you, son, bitch. Savani <laughs> asks for the uh, the train station. The driver, the driver starts to drive. And you know what? Do you know about this shit? He was to Savani. You appear to have accomplished your task. Yeah, yeah, it's all done. Yeah, get out of here. <laughs> yeah, I didn't even have to get my hands dirty that much. I didn't even hit him once. <laughs> <laughs> well, you didn't hit him much. <laughs> I took all the hits. <laughs> was the explosion inside the theater? The explosion was inside the theater. Uh, oh. You could do a spellcraft or knowledge or Kata. Los didn't see it. He was inside his can. So, uh, that noble, huh? Set him up with some goodies inside. Viper, Viper, Viper got messy. That was a messy thing he did. Pretty too good. <laughs> Yeah. Alright. I don't know, I assume this guy would laugh like this. Oh, Viper's not in your carriage. Yeah, I know. I'm talking about him. <laughs> You're not far off. Yeah. That's good, that's good. Hey, uh, I think there's enough time to stop at a bank for a withdrawal. Do you have business with a bank here? No, but I'm sure Vanda, you know, Vilda does. Maybe too much, huh? Too much. Getting a little greedy? Is that it? Yeah. All right. All right. Yeah, roll it. Roll, roll 3d20. <laughs> How much time before the before your train leaves? <laughs> For you to see if you can clear a guy's account. <laughs> four, 13, and 14. Okay, you have 27 minutes. Do you think you'll be able to, without knowing an account number, figure it, like, get money out of the bank that boys have a bit? Yeah, we've done this before. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> <laughs> it starts with, like, going to In the Foundry, box. if it was that bad. <laughs> I don't want to fuck with the bank here. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do good, do good, do good, the soft dress. <laughs> in piece of shit foundry, it was pretty bad. Uh, foundry is a major, major city, man. You, you, you're, we're just from a the character. The character is from a horrible, nice yeah, a horrible neighborhood outside the main part of the city. <clears throat> you make your way back to the train station. She shadow walks you through to the train. Henry is there. Malik is well, there. He gives her the scroll back. She's not asking for it. She She's didn't even... ask. Didn't ask, no? He's she like, didn't ask for it. Do you hand it back? Yeah. She'll take it back. Do you hand it back? He's like, oh, you don't want it? All right. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And the train rides its very quick trip back to the front. Is it going backwards? No. Like, like, is it, is it turned around? Is what I'm asking. You know what I mean? I, 
No, they, they have turnarounds where they take a piece of track and they rotate it and then the train goes the direction. <laughs> Backwards. Or a little loop somewhere. <laughs> there's, there's an occult turn style where they turn the trains around <laughs> where it parks. No, I just didn't know they had one built here. It is. No, they, they have one. Uh, okay, uh, you have your first mythic rank. You successfully succeeded the Doppel King and you do know how you can conceptually steal power, although clumsy in its application. Is it, do I ha can I do it through weapons, like my, uh, my, my sword, for example? Right now, you have a crown that is made of deferral and crafted by doppelgangers. You don't fully understand the concept yet. <laughs> Just stab the people with the horrible crown that nobody can see. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Awesome. What do you want to call tonight? That's, that's fucking awesome. Uh, the greatest swordsman, honestly, because that was no dead, dead. <laughs> like, he did wrong with the king, doppel king. Uh, my crown. It's very well earned. Doppelking? Uh, Doppel. Night at the Opera. Uh, All Hail the Doppelking? Ghost of the Opera? Ghost of the Opera? <laughs> no, it's not. Ghost of the Doppelking. <laughs> <laughs> so you took out the giant, the, the Troll King. He's a tough guy in Bailey. The man. Doppler King? <laughs> the Doppel King of the Opera? <laughs> Doppel King of the Opera? King of the Opera? Hey, family business. <laughs> family business. Nah, that's fine. The doppel, yeah, got the doppel doppel king. Play. That's fine. That that explosion's pretty fucked up, though. Oh. I'm just wondering, did Viper wait for us to leave, or was he like, "I'm just gonna fuck him over in the third round"? <laughs> wow. Well. Everyone didn't die, so somebody's seen. Somebody's probably seen our group leaving right before the explosion. That's not good. That's not good. Yeah. Like it. Well, somebody saw Vilder walking out. Yeah, Vilder, Mort, and Capra. Where are you guys? You <laughs> pull out some fake <laughs> mustaches. Shit himself in a hallway. <laughs> As a distractionary technique. <laughs> He's like a rhinoceros or a hippo or whatever they are, where they're like, oh no, I'm being attacked. Muck spray. <laughs> I thought that'd be funny. You can see me setting it up too, right? Go ahead and get the milk going. Get it nice old. Fucking <laughs> <of> milk. <laughs> well, everyone was trying right? to look in. No, they're not going to look in when you. When you do no. That. No. All right. Not spy. It's late here and we're making lots of noise. So I'm going to end the stream here. That was an awesome game, Adam. Uh, yeah. Th <laughs> thanks for damning. For those watching on YouTube, which is where this episode will appear. Thanks for your support. And as always, we hope you enjoy this as much as we do. Peace. Have a good night. Peace. We'll Happy see you later. Hey, take it easy. The plane's <laughs> night, guys.